Hello learners quality engineering and management week 8 video number 26 the topic is quality function deployment presented by myself Dr. N. Venkateshwarlu associate professor mechanical engineering school of engineering and technology new delhi learners introduction to quality function deployment nowadays the competition in the manufacturing industry is increasing day by day and the companies needs to be competitive in the market. So the companies have to be updated in understanding and finding the changing needs of the customers. The companies should develop the new products in time before the competitors with innovative technologies and futures according to the customer requirements and to satisfy customer satisfaction so here the the competition is going very fast so competition is becoming a, a, uh, a problem for the companies those who are uh, below competitiveness so to improve the competitiveness they have to implement the customer requirements the customer requirements should be find out earlier before the competitors products comes into the market before that the other companies should come with a new innovative ideas so that then only they will be able to compete in the market that is the importance of this quality function deployment therefore to understand the customer needs a new and an innovative technique quality function deployment is used qfd is not only used to know the customer requirements but also to design a new product and services accordingly qfd is also utilized to modify the old products and services as per the new requirements of the customers qfd is an emerging tool in manufacturing and service industries objectives learners after listening this video lecture you should be able to understand what is qfd explain the concept of qfd discuss the applications of qfd explain tangible and intangible benefits of qfd these are the various objectives we are going to discuss in this lecture understanding qfd it is a challenge to understand what the customer exactly want qfd helps to understand the importance of the customer demands quality function deployment is a system for designing a product or service based on customer demands with the participation of members of all functions of supplier organization it translates the customer requirements into appropriate technical requirements for each stage so uh, the actually qfd what it says through qfd quality function deployment the team will participate a team consists of various departmental heads or departmental people so that they can find out exactly the what the customer wants then only they go for the design manufacturing and then sales so like that first one has to identify exactly what the customer wants the customer needs are identified through quality function deployment understanding qfd the activities included in qfd are market research so here various activities we have to see market research basic research innovation concept design prototype design and testing final product or service testing after sales service and troubleshooting so these are the various activities activities in the market research so uh, the mar the market research will be conducted by the market people to understand the customer requirements to know the customer requirements so that that is through various tools such as uh, surveys feedback form various tools they will use through that they will conduct the market research and get the data about the customer requirements customer needs to understand customer needs so these are all the various uh, techniques which will be used to know the customer requirements then basic search basic search about the new products any new product first we have developed a product a 
then we want to develop a new product so when it will de will be developed when it will be uh, uh, means launched like that some basic research one has to conduct then innovation so what innovation we need to include in that new design so it may be suppose it is a um, uh, tele um, uh, mobile phone so in the mobile phone the requirements are changing very fast so there are various innovations are coming up touch phone and various apps various software to be uh, included in the new phones then only the new phones are uh, will be sold easily so that is the importance of innovation innovation in the sense in the manufacturing also manufacturing of cars manufacturing of motorcycle where the innovations are to be uh, incorporated so what innovations now see the electric vehicle earlier petrol diesel then gas then now it is electric vehicles so that some innovation one has to incorporate or you can uh, see that in the uh, what you can say in the car manufacturing itself you can have the computer itself in the uh, computer tv everything will be uh, given in the com new cars those who are coming in the market so that type of innovations are to be included in the new products so this is a uh, one uh, one activity then comes to concept design then prototype design one has to develop complete product of that prototype so then only one can understand how it is running how it is uh, what are the functions it is functioning correctly so that is the prototype they will develop then comes to final product and service uh, testing so when product development final original product development and then again it has to be tested and service testing so then comes to after sales service and then troubleshooting so these are the various activities will be carried out so for this the qfd has to look after what are the customer requirements first so accordingly one has to develop each and every activities these are uh, performed by people with different skills in team whose composition depends on many factors including the products or services being developed and the size of the operation in many industries such as cars video equipment electronics and computers engineering designs designers are seen to be heavily involved in designing but in other industries and service operation designing is carried out by people who do not carry the word designer next the designers of the engine of the automobile have to satisfy the each and every customer and they have different expectations qfd converts these expectations or voice of the customer into engineering or technical requirements for example the expectation of high power would technically mean operation of high torque by the engine qfd helps in determining technical requirements which will give maximum satisfaction of the customer so that is the advantage of qf qfd an overview yoji aka was widely regarded as the father of quality function deployment and his work led to its first implementation at the mitsubishi heavy industries kobe shipyard in 1972 the interest in qfd in the west was stimulated by reports of the achievements made by toyota through its application between 1977 and 1984 these included a reduction in product development cost by 61% a decrease in development cycle by one third and reduced warranty problems so these are all the various advantages through implementing quality function deployment yuji akao defined quality function deployment as a method for developing a design quality aimed at satisfying the customer and then translating the customer demands into design targets and major quality assurance points to be used throughout the production phase this is the definition defined by the yoji account the main features of qfd are its focus on meeting customer needs through the use of their actual statement termed as the voice of the customer its facilitation of multidisciplinary teamwork and the use of a comprehensive matrix for documenting the information 
perceptions and decisions this matrix is commonly referred to as the house of quality hoq and is often perceived to represent quality function deployment in its entirety concept of qb the american society for quality control defines quality function deployment as a structured method in which customer requirements are translated into appropriate technical requirements for each stage of product development and production qfd process is often referred to as a listening to the voice of the customer qfd is is a method that determines customer requirements and measures customer satisfaction yoji akao the japanese quality guru was the founder of quality function deployment technique indian world class software and automobile industries such as trucks automobiles and farm tractors had been implemented this new technique quality function deployment and gained competitive advantage through fulfilling the customer expectations learners ap- applications of qfd after understanding the concept of qfd you must know the application of qfd in manufacturing process research studies identified the following applications setting design quality and planned quality benchmarking competitive products new product development that sets the company apart from the competitors analyzing and accumulating market quality information reducing development costs deploying design intent manufacturing reducing initial quality problems reducing design changes cutting development time expanding the market share here you can see that the reducing development cost so from the designing stage itself suppose we are going to design a new product for that we have to if it is, if its cost increases then again the problem the sales problem so 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 many people may not buy with that cost so in the uh, while the implementing this qfd one has to think about the how to reduce the developmental cost also even reducing divan uh, reducing development time so that is where these two are very important because the one is cost if cost are uh, increased then sales will be the problem if time the development time increases then the competitor will come with his new product then again the problem competitive problem so these are the various aspects we have to think and we have to implement qfd with these objectives and we have to fulfill that objectives so that our product will come in the market before the competitors that is the importance of this qfd significance of qfd qfd has redefined quality control in manufacturing by moving it upstream to quality control for development and design it has shifted the focus of tqm from process oriented quality assurance to design oriented quality assurance in the creation of product development system through qfd practices the new product development time will be reduced and new products will be brought to the market before competitors so this is the significance so here the quality control technique has been shifted from manufacturing quality development to design quality development so from the designs itself one has to think before the quality will be in, uh, the qfd in the qfd process all customer requirements will be implemented starting from the design stage itself so then we can improve of the quality throughout the system from design to manufacturing to sales so that is the importance of this quality function deployment qfd has provided a communication tool for designers engineers or engineers are brought to the level of leading the team in new product development qfd is a powerful tool for engineers to build a system for new product development new product development is an important function in the competitive industry qfd involves the engineers and managers in bringing the 
new products with customer required products with conformity and compliance so these are the various requirements qfd team in operation so one now we have to think about the which uh, team the quality function deployment team so qfd is a powerful product development tools that were developed in japan to transfer the concept of quality control from the manufacturing process into the new product development process the first step of a qfd exercise is to form a cross functional team its purpose is to take the needs of the market and translate them into such a form that they can be satisfied and delivered to the customer so as with all organizational problems the structure of the qfd team must be decided on the basis of detailed requirements of each organization one thing however is clear that close license must be maintained at all times among the design marketing and operational functions represented in the team so what does it mean a qfd team must consist of operational team marketing team and then design team design people all these uh, functional people should be involved in designing or involved in the quality function deployment process the qfd team must answer three questions who what how that is who are the customers what are what do the customer need how will the needs be satisfied these are the various questions for the quality function deployment team learners qfd team in operation who may be decided by asking who will benefit from the successful introduction of this product service or process once the customer have been identified what can be ascertained through interview questionnaire focus group process or from the knowledge and judgment of the qfd team members how is more difficult to determine and will consist of the attributes of the product service or process under development this will constitute many of the action steps in a quality function deployment strategic plan who what and how are entered into a quality function deployment matrix or grid of house of quality which is simple quality table the what are recorded in rows and how are placed in the columns the hvq provides structure to design and development cycle often linked to the construction of a house because of the shape of the matrix when they are fitted together so because of that its shape we can call it as a house of quality the key to building the house is the focus on customer requirement so that design and development process are driven more by what the customer requirements so that the design and development process are driven more by what the customer needs than by innovations in technology this ensures that more effort is used to obtain vital customer information it may increase the initial planning time in a particular development project but the overall time including design and redesign taken to bringing a product or service to the market will be reduced this requires that marketing people design staff and production operation personnel work closely together from the time the new service process or product is conceived the house of quality provides an organization with the with the means for interdepartmental or interfunctional planning and communication starting with the so called customer attributes these are phrases customer used to describe product process and service characteristics the qfd process qfd provides a system of comprehensive development process from two perspectives 
from customer perspective qfd is understanding true customer needs and understanding what value means to the customer this is must one has to understand about the true customer needs then value of the customer so value means to the customers so this is in terms of customer perspective then from producer's perspective qfd is understanding how customers or end users become interested choose and are satisfied analyzing how we know the needs of the customers deciding what features to include determining what level of performance to deliver so uh, because the producer has to think in that way so uh, according to if suppose a car is manufacturing how it should perform what may be the mileage for that car what will be the performance of that car so these are the various aspects one has to uh, get perfectly from the customer and so then producers have to incorporate in during the design process intelligently linking the needs of the customer with design development engineering manufacturing and service functions and design for six sigma with the front end values of the customer analysis and entire design system the qfd methodology can be used for both tangible products and intangible products and intangible services including manufacturing goods services software products it products business process development government services healthcare industry environmental initiatives and many other applications the tangible benefits of qfd are significant reduction in startup and engineering cost elimination of most late engineering changes upfront determination of product process requirement significant reduction in new product development time more efficient allocation of resources then intangible benefits improves customer satisfaction facilitates multidisciplinary teamwork provides a basis for improvement planning establish and maintain documents creates a transferable storehouse of engineering knowledge encourages transfer of training to other projects via all team members these are the various uh, benefits tangible and intangible the learners now the conclusions learners i hope you understood what is quality function deployment the concept of quality function deployment application of quality function deployment the qfd team in operation qfd process tangible and intangible benefits of qfd in the in the next video number 27 you will learn about house of quality and seven management and planning tools